Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel, Timeless Studios, welcome. Here we have a product review. I do apologise to uh, the company for they sent me kindly uh, this product uh, when I asked and I wanted to review the, the product and stuff uh, and it's taken a couple of months for me to actually get this done. I'm kind of glad I didn't do it straight away because my knowledge of recording things this way isn't was, wasn't as uh, knowledgeable, if that's the right word. Uh, I didn't know much on it and stuff. I was still very new. I still am very new. Um, I'm still figuring out things, but I feel now is a great time to review this product. So basically, we're reviewing a product called Odin Guitars. So there we go. The Odin by Solemn Tones. Now again, this company kindly sent me this product. Uh, I didn't know too much about how the product worked and stuff, but I wanted to do something different. Uh, now, now that I'm making some music with this product, it's insane this is such a good software uh, let's go over it so when you load it up it is a standalone software so you do not need contact <coughs> or anything like that so this is basically your software the odin 2 if you go to drop bar you can get picked pan rhythms essentials pan leads essentials which is basically the pan rhythms it's the left and right Pan lead left and right, or if you want to do them separately, you can have guitar one, guitar two. You have also pan rhythm expanded and pan lead expanded, and obviously disabled. Now, so the expanded gives you let's go into the info knob here. The expanded gives you all these key key switches. So when you want to do a bend, you just follow where this key switch happens and boom, which I shall demonstrate in a second. Uh, the humanizer knob, knob meh, uh, depends how much more of a human error feel you want to it. Uh, you just bring the knob all the way up, but I tend to have it around these two just here. And um, the crank gives it more of a fucking oomph to it, more raw. So, you know, and while it's playing with the key changes, it tells you in just this box just here. The advanced knob, you've got latching and non-latching, force phase, raw mode, octave drop, bend intensity, decay intensity, and tremolo intensity, where you can just fiddle with your heart's content and what you feel that sounds good to your particular song. So it's very simple. It's a... Uh, it's a very simple software. It's great because it's just a standalone. You don't need contact. Um, it looks great. I'm loving, loving it. I hope you enjoy it if you're using it or if you got it or if you're just starting out like I am. Let's get to the actual track part of it. Now, this is no way near the finished product or <coughs> the uh, finished tone or anything like that. So, um, you have to bear with when it comes to uh, the tone and stuff at the moment. But so with this song so far, I'm going to show you what I use. Yeah. <laughs> so for the guitars, I'm using Odin, and this is what this new project I'm making for is. So I'm going to use just Odin guitar and all MIDI. So I'm not going to perform any of it. I'm just going to pretty much just play it, not play it program it so for the time being i am using the dominator by uh audio assault amazing plugin cost me like five dollars when they had it out on sale it's uh, probably one of my go-to guitar plugins it's amazing i love it we got the amped roots by fluff which uh, Solemn Tones did like a little thing with, and it sounded amazing for my lower guitar tones. It's pretty cool. I like that. For bass, I'm using my 
Jin by Submission Audio. An insane bass. I feel like this is probably one of the best bass plugins I've used so far. And then for drums, as always my go-to drums, we have my Superior Drummer Free. And I'm using Modern Metal Dark, which is pretty, pretty nice software. So uh, yeah, let's. Uh, I'm going to play the uh, the song. song's not pretty much it's not 100 percent finished almost finished but it's a new project i'm working on with a friend of mine and uh i'm very excited to uh get this out so uh yeah so odin guitars an amazing software amazing software see so, yeah, it again it's you don't have to have contact which is great um with with the Odin, if you just have the essentials, if you just like to do it, like just box standard, Swift on, it'll just, it does it all itself for you. Well, just won't do the bends, I guess. Uh, so at the moment I'm pushing myself to use the non-Swift so I can actually make it better for myself to write songs that sound more like a realistic guitar. 
a uh, friend actually thought I actually when I showed him the song he actually thought I was actually playing guitar no way I can play this sort of stuff so uh yeah that's basically it really it's an amazing software it's worth the money if you decide to go down this route this is probably the only guitar software that I've used that I thought sounded quite realistic um and actually sounds like someone's playing your song so uh which is amazing uh, I've got like some other guitar MIDI softwares <coughs> which sounds nice and stuff again with the velocity of the MIDI you can't have them all the way up otherwise it does like this high pitch <coughs> noise and stuff like that so uh, you have to really dive in and play around with velocity and stuff to make it actually sound like a guitar actually playing Thank you for tuning in to this product review. Again, uh, apologies to Solemn Tones for not doing this sooner. Uh, again, I feel like that if I did it back then, um, it wouldn't have been as knowledgeable as I know now than I did when I first got the product. Um, I'm glad that I have had a chance to play around with it and play the song and start making some music with this software uh, and i hope to make more songs with this software and i'd like to try out the whole loki bass and the other bass softwares and their drums just to see how well all of the one pro uh, all the one software company in one song instead of using like other plugins here and there sort of thing so maybe one day so thanks again for tuning in i hope you enjoyed this i hope this has persuaded you to get the uh, Odin 2, it's not cheating. Some people will probably prefer to MIDI stuff than actually performing stuff. If you can't play some of the riffs that are, I'm making, then it's the best bet. And you can, yeah, it's just great. It's just great. Please go and check out Solemn Tones. Please subscribe and leave a comment and let me know what you think. Till next time. Thanks.